Welcome back to Oshkosh Today. Thanks again for joining us. Uh, now we have our final guest of the day in here, uh, Connie, Connie Carmichael and Cheryl Rosenthal from the Oshkosh Humane Society and Shop Local Oshkosh, uh, here to tell us about a really cool initiative that we have coming up here. So first of all, ladies, thank you both so much for joining us today. Thank you. Thank, thank you, you for having us. Yes, it's always a pleasure. Um, and we've got a really cool event to talk about uh, here today. Connie, maybe you can give us a little background first on what exactly Shop Local is here in Oshkosh. Absolutely. It's, um, kind of uh, it's a new thing um, in Oshkosh relatively new uh, but it's kind of um, we're out there to kind of change the way people think about shopping and supporting nonprofits in our area um, it's a great uh, it's a great way to uh, get drive more business into our local businesses as well as support our local nonprofits yes and you're here specifically today to talk about the the our Shop Local Week. Yes, your Shop Local Week helping to back up your nonprofits, like you said. So what exactly is the Shop Local Week? Well, Shop Local Week is coming up on February 23rd through March 1st. And uh, we're going to have like a passport thing. So you're traveling through Oshkosh and supporting local oh. businesses. But by at the same time, we are going to have drop-off sites throughout the city um, to where people can come in and drop off items for the Humane Society. Um, and in a minute, Cheryl will uh, let you know what types of items those are that the Humane Society needs. Um, but if I could, I'd like to list the drop-off sites, um, yes. which are... very important part of the yes, week here. Yes, Oshkosh um, Heating and Air, um, it, which is going to be on Main Street, Kits and File, uh, Mark and Susie's Piggly Wiggly, Castle's TV and Appliance, Ambassador Travel, Oshkosh Lanes, Players Pizza, Park and Print, um, and of course the Oshkosh Area Humane Society. They go there, they drop off the items uh, for the Humane Society. They get, uh, they can pick up their passports at any of these locations, as well as the other supporters that are on, um, which we will have over 50 businesses, and we will list those on our Facebook page and our, our social media. They get their stamps. If they get stamp, if they get 10 or more stamps, they qualify to win over 100 prizes. Ooh. If they get 25 or more stamps, they qualify to win a big screen TV. Um, but it's it's just awesome. We're so excited to have the Humane Society on board uh, to help kick off this first one of the year. Yes, and Cheryl, you're here from the Humane Society. Uh, yes. And, you know, all these great places to drop off things that you guys need, which is a continuous thing, you know, yes, at the Humane there's Society. There's a continuous need, always. Yeah. What kind of things are you... Um, looking for you know right now in this season okay i can't wait to go shopping after hearing her talk i know i know <laughs> connie has that effect um, on you doesn't you know, she <laughs> there's a lot of we have a lot of need um uh -huh. and so the basics primarily we can always use paper toweling uh -huh. um cat and dog canned cat and dog food uh canned food for the cats we like the pate style uh large rolled raw hides uh purita one we try to feed the cats and dogs a basic uh, food and so Purina products, Purina One is a good uh, middle of the road uh, food for us to feed. It's mm -hmm. not the highest quality but yet it's a good food to feed and so um, if w when you have so many dogs and they're under a lot of stress or animals at the shelter are stressed it's just better for their tummies uh, to have one basic food and so we've we've stayed with the Purina One. Mm -hmm. uh, we always have a high need for soft dog treats like the canine carryouts or pepperoni, things like that. Um, but sometimes people say, well, why, why the soft dog treats? And people need to remember that these are animals that are in a stressful situation. And especially, I'm gonna use medical exam for an example. Um, we're checking in a dog and we have to look in their mouth and look at their teeth. We have to look in their ears. We have to take their temperature. All of these things are th things that are going to make the dog very uncomfortable and the dog will be more responsive and more respectful of a soft dog treat rather than a dry biscuit. It's kind of like asking me to do so asking you to do something you're not real thrilled about and I offer you, well, would you like a cracker or would you like an ice cream cone? <laughs> uh, and so, you know, I'd rather have the ice cream cone. So those soft treats are, are really important to us. We also use the soft dog treats for um, tr training purposes uh, with the dog. So another soft dog treat that we really enjoy have receiving at the shelter, it's the, um, it's a, it's called natural balance food roll. It oh. looks like a big summer sausage and we can cut that up into to mini treats. Uh, and that's, that's another product that people can buy for us uh, that, we, that we can use. Um, so we have an entire list of, of our needs on our website. Yes. Um, dog toys, right now we have a huge need for durable dog toys. 
um, again, for safety reasons, we can't use the rope toys. Dogs are not under supervision when they're in their kennel. So if they have the rope toy, they can shred parts mm -hmm. of that and ingest it, and then we're looking at a vet bill. Mm -hmm. um, so we're looking for uh, some of the sewn dog toys uh, with the squeaky toys, cloth, something that's really durable, uh, the plastic squeak toys, uh, the Kongs that can be stuffed. There oh, are yes. uh, toys that you can put <laughs> treats in. Uh, so any of those toys are greatly appreciated. And the neat thing about the Kongs and the other puzzle type toys, it keeps the dogs busy, but they're washable. And that's another thing for people to keep in mind when they're purchasing things for the Humane Society. We need things that are washable. And think about, can I put this in my wash machine and wash and dry it economically? And if you can't, neither can we. So um, those are the things that we look at. We're, we're trying to do things that are going to be um, useful and good for the animals, but also not be hard for us to dry or to care for. Wonderful. Yes, like, I mean, such a long list of things. So there's really anything that right. you can keep an eye out for sales, too, as right. you're doing office your regular supplies. Shipping. A lot of times people forget about office supplies. Mm -hmm. We go through a lot of copy paper, pens, staplers, scotch tape, all the basic things that you use in your home office, we use at the shelter. Mm -hmm. uh, and so those things, too, are, are very important. Yes, and you know, it's a never-ending need at the Humane Society, like you yes. said. Um, you can find a full list on the Oshkosh Area Humane Society's yes. website. Yep. So go to oahs.org yes. and uh, look for wish list, and we will have our most needed list, and then we will have a very extensive list. And then you also, I would invite people to look at things that we cannot use. Sometimes people will bring us uh, sheets and pillowcases and pillows. Again, we can't use those things, but there are certain kinds of bedding of blankets that we can use. Uh, and when in doubt, give us a call yes. and ask for me. I'll be happy to talk to you and tell you specifically what we are looking for. Great. And are people able to make monetary donations on the website as well? If they Yes. Okay. We have our Donate Now button. Uh, they can make a general donation um, or they can become a member or by looking at the different ways to donate, they can decide how they would like to uh, give a gift to the Humane Society. They can also do a tribute or a memorial if they've had, um, I have a birthday coming up, I'm hoping that my friends, if they want to buy me something for my birthday, instead of doing that, make a gift That's to the Humane cool. Society uh, in my That's honor. That would, mm -hmm. that would make me just so happy. Uh, to have even know that existed. That yeah. Very so, cool. Uh, a lot of options. Weddings, right. uh, you know, something, you know, person that has everything. You don't know what to buy them, but you know that they're a great advocate for the animal shelter. Mm -hmm. um, do a gift in their honor and they will receive, uh, they will get a letter from us saying that a gift was made in their honor. So that's great. a great way um, to remember someone, whether they're living or have passed. So tons and, of options. And during Shop Local Week, the drop-off sites, um, we're also going to put up things for people to drop money in awesome. as well. If Perfect. they, don't, if they forget wonderful. to bring something, um, right. then um, then they can drop off money at the drop-off stations right. as well. Right. So another yes. way of right. doing that. So we don't have a ton of time left. So yep. Connie, if you want to give us some more information about if we um, are looking to if plan. I, if I could, um, if, if any business is looking to yes. be a part of it, uh, they have until Fe February 6th, which is just a couple of days away but if I could just run through real quick um, on some of the businesses that are part of it that are going to be supporting uh, Shop Local Week as well as the Humane Society. Uh, Bar 430, Kits and File, Ambassador Travel, Baranchek Lawn Care, Rodney's Cafe, Castles TV and Appliance, Planet Perk, Atomic Cats, Rhymer Jewelry, um, Oshkosh Heating and Air, Magnet, uh, Mark and Susie's Piggly Wigsley, Wiggly, Maryland's uh, Resale. Um, there's going to be uh, Oshkosh Lanes, there are going to be at least 50 some or more. You can look at our Facebook or go to our website. We're going to have a list on there. And um, I just really quick too also want to say a shout out to Paul Wagner from Reimer Jewelry. He is also our February Business of the Month. So mm. you can look for a chance to win a heart necklace in the month of February. Um, like wow, and share us on timing. Facebook. Yes. And yes. support the Humane Society. Yes. So mm -hmm. look at, for a shop local online. Find the website. Facebook page is very, yep. very Social good about media, being updated. Twitter, um, Pinterest, any of those. Yes. As well as the Oshkosh Area Humane Absolutely. Society's right. and website. And we will be sharing, you know, when they get that information to us, we will be sharing that on our website and our Facebook page as well. Wonderful. And pick up your passports all around yes. town. Yes. I will be picking mine up. I'm, I'm, I saw the picture of the TV we just showed, and I'm pretty interested 
interested in that one. So <laughs> yeah. I'll, be, I'll be making my rounds. Shopping. <laughs> yes, That's well, right. I'll be shopping right. and giving at the same time. That's so right. Wonderful. Thank you. It's a win-win for everyone. Yes, yes. Okay. We can't wait. And so thank you so much again, Connie and Cheryl, for coming in today and telling us all about this awesome week. Thank, thank you. you.